And um, I, had, I, had, I had this inspiration of this thing that I wanted to be able to do. And I sat down with Arthur and worked out a protocol. And um, I call it SYN, S-Y-N. And it, if that, the reason I call it that is that the, um, that's the prefix for, thing, for words like synthesis and, symbi and symbiosis. It's the prefix from the Greek, which means with or together. And um, what I wanted to be able to do is create a, a whole chain DNA that would be a general purpose DNA for doing real-time applications like Google Docs, or if you've used HackMD or you've used Miro, when people can simultaneously move objects or type at the same time. Because frankly, if there's like there's no there's no uh, app I'll ever use anymore that isn't collaborative for the most part, yep. right? Like, do I use Word or Excel? No, I use Google Docs and Google Spreadsheet or, or um, HackMD. And so there's a part of me that realized that there's, it just makes no sense to have an application that doesn't have that real time ability to update and work together with people because we're pretty much always working together with people. Yep. And so I wanted to figure out what's the protocol and between the user interfaces to be able to do that kind of updating? And what do we need to have underneath in Holochain to support that? And so, yeah, I sat down with Art and came up with a protocol. It was, took us an afternoon to figure out how to do it. And then I spent a week with my, uh, my son, with Will, and we wrote, in, yeah, you know, it was a couple, two, three hours a day, maybe a little bit more. We wrote the code and got um, a proof of concept. This isn't like Google Docs yet but a proof of concept that'll work across a bunch of different applications um, to do that kind of uh, real-time collaboration.